test is performed for comparing two groups when we have more than two groups we cannot use student t-test and in that case we will have to use one way and over that also we will learn today so for explaining student t-test i am going to take one example so here we have chosen the example of two drugs where i am giving drug a to a patient and i am giving drug b to second patient for weight reduction so they have reduced 15 kg and 22 kg weight respectively and we have done this experiment in three trials and we have got different type of results which you can see in this table so by using this data we we have we have made the graphs as we discussed in the previous class also by using graph prism so this is how we have entered the data into this excel into this file of graph prism and this is the graph which we are getting so this bigger box are representing the mean value while the error words which you are seeing on the top is representing the standard deviation here however now we have to learn how to compare them how to find, find out which is better drug so basically uh, by seeing this data itself you can say drug B is more better than drug A however whether this difference is significant or not that we can only identify after doing statistical analysis so in this case as only two groups are there I am going to use student t-test if it would be more than two groups then I might be using one way ANOVA so we are using t-test so in the window top part of the window you can see option of analyze where the cursor is I am clicking on that option analyze here I am going to select student t-test as you can see here t-test and I will click on ok here there are various options of doing t-test t-test can be done paired as well as unpaired it can be performed one tailed or two tailed as you can see options available here it can be performed on 95% 99% 90% confidence limits however right now I am going to do it with default settings I am just clicking ok so when I am clicking ok I am getting the analysis of t-test this is the entire analysis here you can find out the difference so here I am identifying that unpaired t in unpaired t-test the p-value summary I am getting is 1 star it means there is significant difference however the significant difference is not very strong otherwise here we will find more than one star higher the number of stars higher the difference of higher the difference in the level of significance so what we can conclude based on this information is among these two drugs drug b is more effective however there is not very high level of significance though it is significantly higher so that's all about student t-test you can practice it doing like this you can also try to do it with different parameters you can change the settings into the options which i showed to you